Most students have heard of the word plagiarism, but some aren't entirely sure of what it means. In college courses, we are continually engaged with other people's ideas. We read them in texts, hear them in lectures, discuss them in classes, and incorporate them into our own writings. As a result, it is very important that we give credit where it is due. Plagiarism, then, is when we take other people's ideas and use them as our own without properly providing credit to those sources. The Webster's New Collegiate Dictionary refers to plagiarism as the stealing and passing off the ideas or words of another as one's own, and to present as new and original an idea or product derived from an existing source. Some students think that piracy of information is abundant in this era of social media, so taking ideas without properly providing credit isn't a big deal. However, there are severe consequences. You can fail the assignment if your instructor finds out you've plagiarized. You can even fail the class. Some academic institutions suspend or expel their students for plagiarizing. At Miracosta, instances of academic dishonesty are reflected on transcripts. In other words, your academic reputation is on the line. So what are some good strategies in helping students avoid plagiarism? Use your own ideas. It should be your paper and your ideas are the focus. Write a draft of your paper without any notes to help you use your own words and ideas. For an average community college level research paper, 90% of the ideas should be yours, while 10% can be supporting ideas from other sources. That's just a general rule of thumb. Also, when you use the ideas of others, use them only to support or reinforce your own argument. When taking notes, include complete citation information for each item you use. You'll save yourself a lot of time not having to try to track down a source later on. Also, remember to use quotation marks when directly stating another person's words. One last item regarding plagiarism that sometimes confuses students. Quoting versus paraphrasing. To quote means that you are using the author's exact words in your text. Quotes should be in quotation marks. An in-text or parenthetical citation is needed when you're quoting. To paraphrase means to restate the words of the author in your own words. In your document, your restating of the original content is not in quotation marks. An in-text or parenthetical citation is also needed when you're paraphrasing. Miracosta College librarians are here to help. If you need assistance, drop by any of the reference desks at our three campuses, or chat with us live online 24-7 using our Ask a Librarian service which is located on the library's homepage.